Hello there everybody and welcome back to Mario Party 3 and uh, we're on the last turn here in Spiny Desert so thank goodness uh, it's almost over. I mean don't get me wrong I love this board and all but I'm ready to move on. Yeah yeah stores closed because it's the last turn blah 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 I don't care. Anyways here's the action time so all you gotta do is jump over these cactuses and uh, hey I did it. Nice. And hey that was the real Millennium Star. Nice. Cool. So uh, yeah, I don't remember what happens if you miss the cactuses. Sorry guys, I don't remember. And I'm not going back to re-record, I'm afraid, so again, sorry about that. Man, those are some big scorpions over there. It's amazing all the things you miss in the background when you aren't looking, you know, or when you're playing, and then all of a sudden you are pl aren't playing and you're just talking about it, and it's like, whoa, I didn't notice that before. There are those camels up there, but I already talked about them before, so what the... Okay. I was going to say, what the heck did she just find? She just found a hidden block with 20 coins. Lucky you, Peachy. Lucky you. You're still in last place by coin, though, so, uh... Yeah, we'll, we'll have to wait and see if that changes. Oh, boy, though. Mario just hit the happening spaces, and, and you know... They're all three on the same space now, so who's he gonna duel? Is he gonna duel Wario, or is he gonna duel, duel Peach? He chose Wario. Ooh, 42 coins, he's going all in. Ooh, man, he's trying to put Wario in last and get himself in second. Very brave of you, Mario, but will it pay off? We'll find out. In Motor Rooter, or Motor Rotor, whatever it's called. I think it's pronounced Rooter, though, since there's two O's. Yeah, this is actually one of my favorite uh, dual minigames, personally. Not only because it's a minigame that Luigi can win by doing absolutely nothing, but also because uh, it's just simple fun. You know, you just drive around, try to hit all the speed boosts and avoid all the lightning strands. You know, it's pretty simple fun. Uh, if I had to complain about anything, though, the control can get a little awkward when you start going around a full circle, you know? You can actually drive on the ceiling and whatnot, and in some cases like there, you have to drive up towards the ceiling. And I don't know, the controls just seem to, like, reverse when you get up there or something like that. It's really weird, and I don't get it entirely. But that said, I still like this minigame. It's still fun. If I had to complain about anything else, though, I really hate when you get struck by lightning just how much it slows you down. It's like, come on. Don't slow me down that much. Like, you saw a warrior there, he just... Well, if he hadn't hit the speed boost there, he would have been, you know, really slowed down. But, oh, look at that! Mario pulls it out! Wow! Congratulations, Mario. You have officially earned second place and put your enemy down to fourth place. Wow. Round of applause for that. That was a good performance. Yeah, but Mario can get some revenge in Thwompool if we can beat him, so I guess we'll have to wait and see what happens. Will Mario get his revenge? Find out in the next few minutes. Though, I gotta say it, this minigame can be fun when you're playing alone, but when you're playing with, uh, uh, Computers? No. 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 Because nine times out of ten they tend to screw up and it's not fun. I don't like that, but uh, it is what it is. Good news is I only have to push one button, so yay. And it does, does kind of go in a pattern usually. Yep, so A, Z. Or no, it doesn't go in a pattern. Or does it? Nope, no pattern. They yeah, are tied right now, but uh, we'll see if that'll last. I don't think it's going to last. I think I think one of us is going to pull it out last second at this rate. Because we are dead even. Oh boy. Ooh, come on. Alright, just barely got it. Yep. Alright, so Wario gets his revenge, but he's still in last place. So, sucks be you, Wario. Sucks be you. I think Peach is going to get second, though, with the happening star, though, if I'm honest. But we'll see. We shall see in the bonus stars. Oh crap, Mario's got more coins than me. Does that mean he gets the coin star then? I don't know. I can't remember if it's the most coins overall or if it's the most coins at the end of the game, if I'm honest. I, I forgot for whatever reason. I'm drawing a blank. I don't know why. But anyways, here we go. Spiny Desert is finally over. We can move on to the next board. Which I think is Woody Woods, so I'm not looking forward to that. But first we gotta get through the dual map, because uh, I'm going to now. Someone's going to try and stop me from getting my stamp, and it's going to... Yeah, yeah, I nah, can't talk today. 
and it's going to result in a uh, duel mini game. I'm calling it now. There, there's no way it's not going to happen. It's already happened with Wario. It's already happened with Luigi. It's going to happen again. I guarantee it. If I'm wrong, I'll eat my hat. Okay. Oh, I got it. Peach got the happening star. And yep, it's most coins overall, so I won the coin star. Yay. So yeah, Peach got second, Mario third, Wario last. Me, first place as I should be. Bye, Wario. Bye, Mario. Bye, Peach. I still find it quite sadistic that you're killing my friends because they didn't win Millennium Star, but, uh... Then again, Wario and Mario have appeared in other boards before, and they came back, so maybe they have extra life mushrooms on them or something? I don't know. I don't know, I just, I still think it's sadistic to drop them to their doom, but that's just me. Freaking tumble with this constant changing moods, ugh, creepy. So disturbing. Seriously, we need an animatronic of him, Spirit Halloween. All right, got another S rank. Fantastic. So that's five now. Just as I expected, Yoshi. Now I should give you a strength star stamp, despite the fact that you picked Peach to win the board, right? Freaking idiot. Freaking liar. I called it, guys. I called it. So now we got Donkey Kong here. Hello, Donkey Kong. Let me guess, you want that stamp too, don't ya? Can you even understand what he's saying, Tumble? This ape claims that he has greater strength than any and everyone. Really? Wanna sell this in Super Smash Brothers, bro? What shall we do? Sell in Super Smash Brothers, I just said it. Oh, stop hitting me, stupid star! A duel have to decide it. Onto Pipe Squeak's duel map you go. Seriously, if you keep hitting me, I'm gonna sucker punch you. Seriously, that's just getting ridiculous now. Well, if you're ready, let's go to Pipe Squeak. And uh, Pipe Squeak is uh, actually the first duel map I ever played when I was a kid, so this one holds a lot of memories for me. Remember my first time playing it with my sister, and we didn't know what we were doing, so it's like, wait, what? We're attacking each other and whatnot? Welcome, Yoshi. Do round three is for the Shrink Star Stamp. Yep. You'll play on this map in this round. All right, bring it on. Pipe Squeak, a map with pipes for warping, and I love this one. This is probably my favorite, honestly. Now let's meet the challenger. I can outpower anyone, Donkey Kong. I thought Donkey Kong didn't speak. Fine, let's go over the rules. In story mode, the number of turns is set to 20 turns. The handicap option is off. Let's battle out fair and square. Please do not cheat. If this is mini game, mini game setup. All mini games are selected. Are you ready? Always ready. Okay, start the duel. It's time to do 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 like Yu-Gi-Oh. In case you didn't get the reference. It all seems to have the same background. Now I think about too all those little cutouts there. That's interesting. I never really thought about that before. All right, Donkey Kong, bring it on. I will show you that I am stronger than you. I'm bigger. Well, not bigger. I'm faster and I'm stronger though. And yeah, we, we've already seen all this, so I'm just skipping it from now on, okay? Screw it. At least this time. I, I'm pretty sure I skip it from this point forward, though, because there's no point. It's the same dialogue every time. You guys really want me to read the same dialogue every time? No, you don't. If you do, then that's just weird. Oh, boy, he's got a thwomp. It. Wait, what? Oh, he doesn't have any attack points. That's why I put him behind him. Okay, that makes perfect sense, then. Yeah, why, why would you want a partner that doesn't have any attack points or anything about That's kind of ridiculous. I guess he's a good defender, but why? The whole idea is to attack each other and whatnot. So what What the? What gives? What gives, game? Uh-oh. Oh, no. I'm about to get attacked. Oh, man. That is so OP. Seriously, nerf that. Nerf that, Nintendo. Seriously, that's ridiculous. That is so overpowered. Oh my god. Again, why would you want that? I don't get that. Alright, do I get the pipe I want? I do not. I get the pink one. Gosh darn it. Alright, what's going to happen? What is going to happen? Am I going to return to start? Lose 10 coins or gain 20 coins? I am going to return to start. Okay, I will take that just fine. Thank you very much. Bring me back to start. Let's see if we can get 
Get ourselves another partner, cause why not? Didn't plan on doing that in one turn, but whatever. I'll take it, I guess. Just dump it, okay. So you wanna say, as long as it's not towed, I'm okay. Yep, see you again. Yeah, Coop is only one coin, that's not bad. Yeah, you don't have anybody to attack me, so. You're out of luck, pal. Ooh, taking a shot with Game Guy, are you? This could be costly, Donkey Kong. Are you sure you, sure you don't want to go through the pipe instead? Well, it's too late anyways, but still. Which one will he get? He shall get the worst one of the bunch, or one of the worst. In fact, no, this is the second worst. The worst is the roulette one, which we won't be seeing till the end of the game. I don't even know if that's even playable. Uh, in the story mode or not, but, uh, or even the main party mode, but here, it's all 50-50. You just gotta pick a box and hope that Toad is in it for whatever reason. In reality, you should be hoping it's Baby Bowser, cause screw Toad, but, uh, apparently no, you want Toad for whatever reason, for whatever reason. It's all 50-50. And he picked wrong, so he doesn't get anything. Yeah, sucks to be you. Sucks to be you, Donkey Kong. Yeah, I think you're overselling a bit there, Donkey Kong. I mean, come on, that, that hammer hits you on the head, but you don't have to flop like that. Like, come on, man. Someone sent him back to wrestling school so he can learn how to sell properly. No real point in attacking him, but screw him, I'm gonna do it anyways. Why not? He's gonna lose him next turn anyways, but screw it, I'm doing it anyways. Why not? Why not? Hey, if I'm lucky, I'll hit a reverse and I hit Donkey Kong, but, uh... We shall see about that. We shall see. I don't think I will, though. Nope. That's unfortunate. Eh, could always hit him. His swamp again. Nope. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's not good. That is not good. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. I, I, I'm in a bad spot right now, guys. I'm in a bad spot. I'm playing Game Guys minigame. It's the Chain Chomp one, though, so maybe I got a chance. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Game guy, sweet surprise. Want to hear the rules? The big chomp and the little chomp will have a cake eating race. Predict which one will be the quicker cake eater. Try saying that five times fast. If you guess right, you'll get more coins. But if you guess wrong, your coins will be mine. Place your bet, then make your guess. Feed him faster. It's too sweet. Let's go with feed him faster. Big chomp it is, let's begin. Hope you guys like my game guy impression. I'm trying to make him sound kind of like a game show host, since, you know, it basically is a game show. Uh-oh. Come on, big guy. Eat, eat, eat! There we go. Whew. All right. Cool. I win, yay. That's how it's done, Donkey Kong. Of course, my main game was different, but still, that's how it's done, baby. Oh, yeah. Hear it. And now he loses his partner because he can't pay him. Too bad. Yeah, can't can't work for free around in Mushroom Kingdom, apparently. I never would have guessed that. I wonder how much the Toads get paid in Peach's Castle. I wonder how much Toad's worth makes. I'm just curious now. And someone's texting me, but I'll check that later. I'm with you guys right now, don't you worry. Oh boy. Mmm. Let's take a shot, see if we can't uh, get the yellow pipe, or not the yellow pipe, the pink pipe, but no, we got the purple pipe. Duh. Not again, come on! Freaking game guy again! Oh, we're getting way too much game guy this part, seriously. Once is enough, not three times. Well, two times for me, but you know what I mean. And we already seen game guys lucky seven, or at least I shown the rules and everything, so screw it, we're just gonna get right into it. <laughs> One pathetic. Si oh yeah, suck on that game guy. Mm, I think I'll hit the dice block once more. Oh no, I only got three. Well, this sucks. Oh, I lost. What? You're still on step six? If you hit the die one more time and stop around the seventh step, your coins will increase tenfold. But if you fall off, your coins will be mine. So we try it again. Nope. I'm just taking my winnings and going. Screw you, game guy. 
I wonder if Game Guy's gonna be in the new one. That'll be interesting if he is. Yep, two in a row. I am officially the conqueror of Game Guy's games. For now, at least. I'm sure that won't last forever. Alright. Let's see what he gets. Yeah, he gets 10 coins. We all know that. What shall he get? An Earthwomp or a bomb? Oh boy, that's not good. That's not good, because I can actually jump over my partners and hit me. But he's actually putting him behind him. That's an interesting choice. I guess DK as a computer is more of a defender than an attacker, which isn't how the game's played, dude. But that's not how it's played. You're supposed to be attacking and, you know, take, taking people's hearts away. Do you not understand how the game works? Should I have ex should I have let the rules play out so you could figure it out? I I don't know. All right, he's not too far away, so let's not take a shot with the pipe. Let's just go down here and play a mini game instead. Yay! What shall it be though? Let's find out, and then we'll end the part here. All right, so next time we will be playing Vine with me, one of my favorites. I'll see y'all then. Later.